question for Marvin in Syracuse. Marvin Graves opened up his Heisman campaign by being named Big East Offensive Player of the Week. Three touchdown passes, 66 yards rushing against Ball State. Would he have a ball against East Carolina Thursday night? Heisman Trophy candidate getting it done early. The runner turns into the passer. Shelby Hill in stride. 27 yards, 7 nothing Orange. Later first, Graves airs it out. There's no messy Marvins on this play. It's Marvin Graves to Marvin Harrison, 14 nothing Orange. In the fourth, Marvin the runner. He's got a couple of big blockers in front of him, and he uses them well. Then he cuts back across the field. In all five touchdowns, Graves accounts for three rushing, two passing in the Orange roll. My score, 41-22. They are now 12-1 away from home under Paul Pasqualoni. Graves buried the Pirates in the third quarter when he went 7-for-7. Seven seven. So two... In Ypsilanti, Michigan, Eastern coach Ron Cooper fired up. Temple's Ron Dickerson the same. He liked what he saw early first quarter. Eddie Wabarocha fumbles. Tony Angelo picks it up, goes 33 yards, puts Temple up by a score of 7 to nothing after a field goal made it 10 nothing in the first. The Eagles' Craig Thompson taking the kickoff. He would not stop. Goes the distance, 87 yards. Eastern gets on the board. Temple would win it 31-28, staving off a late comeback attempt by Eastern. Thompson's return for a score was the longest since the stadium opened back in 1960.